Just the guitar, okay, cool. So I decided to try out 3.0 on this quad. I'll show you how it flies. Plenty of power too. That's with a 600 milliamp hour nanotech. Using a JST, I swapped it over. Took off the canopy. I don't have the rates high enough to do flips yet. I guess I could uh, turn that up. And then I could show you my uh, PIDs too. So the motors aren't even fairly warm. So that's a good thing. cord darn cord guess I'll try this one this one has been acting up but Okay, so here's my PIDs, 60, 70 on P, 30, I, 40, D, and then I got my super rate at zero, and my RC rate's 215 for the yaw, which is perfect, and then this, this rate needs to go up some, and once you get to two, every one that you go up jumps up 30 degrees per second, so, so it's a lot faster. So probably like 2.30 maybe would be good for nice and snappy. Try that out. Oh yeah, much better. Ah! Ah! <laughs> That's funny. I don't know. I don't remember if I had a freaking air mode on. I don't think it was. Watch out, Alyssa. You're going to get ran over. Yes? 
So in the configuration for 3.0, you gotta switch this to brush. In earlier, any earlier versions, you used PWM, and then down here, you'd, and then down here you'd put 32,000. I got mine at 2,000. Um, I don't think I see any difference between 2,000 and 32,000, but let's see anyway, just for fun. 32,000 brushed. Okay. My CPU load is 20%. And I got it on 4 and 2. <clears throat> I'll try a couple different settings too while I'm doing this. Nothing, I'm just doing a video, Alyssa. Yeah. <clears throat> there we go. All right. So let's try to do a flip again. Oh, that was fast. <laughs> that might have been a little too fast, but I don't fly very good while I'm sitting down. So yeah, it was, huh? Okay, let's try that again. Ah! <laughs> Man. Yeah, it's funny. Funny to you. <laughs> Alright. Everything is still all good. Tough little frame. Okay. Alright. Whoa. It, I think I got the rates a little bit too high. I think I'll go to uh, 220. Actually, yeah. I'll go to 220. I'm not going to mess with the rates on my radio. It's best just to go with one or the other. Okay, Alyssa. So I'll just do two. I'll drop it down 10. Yeah, that feels a little bit better. There we go. Yeah, that feels just perfect. So 220 for the RC rate, uh, 215 for the yaw, and then zero for the super rate on all three. And it flies just perfect. Let me just fly around the living room for a minute. Do a little funnel action.
Yeah, that flies awesome. So I definitely would recommend going with 3.0. It seems to me that they've done a lot of stuff to make it um, more brushed quad friendly. Motors are barely even warm after all that, which is awesome. Let's see what the weight is. I kind of added a little bit of weight with this bigger battery because I was using those 500 milliamp hour um, E-Flight ones from the NQX2. But I also took the canopy off and a couple other little screws and stuff. So, I don't know. It used to be 40... No, it was 57 before... Okay, so I added two grams. Not bad. It has a ton of power, so. And it flies amazing, so it's not bad. 59 grams. There you go.